All right, real man. Got I mean, the H, I felt, man. I felt a strong tug, and I was like, <laughs> "Oh, it's a drop." <laughs> <laughs> that's why I was taking it goofy. But that's a nice one, though. Yeah, that's pretty fat. <laughs> Nice. That's a really big one. There he goes. Sweet. Not there target species, but hopefully we'll get something <laughs> way bigger than that. Oh, he's pulling. He keep it. Just fighting. keep. You gotta haul him in though, because there's some rocks out there. That thing smacked it. <laughs> oh, he's fighting this shit. <laughs> oh, oh, nice. <laughs> oh. Here, let me get the net. Or I'll just grab him. <laughs> nice. Oh, oh my god. That's a beauty. Okay, let's let's weigh it. Get a line. But that's a that's that's a nice fish, dude. There we go, 30 pounder. So you can put him in? Yeah, you can put him back if you're ready. <sighs> Goodbye, beastie. Oh, man. Nice, dude. Got a one bite. I don't know if he's still there or not. Bluegill. Yeah, we got him. Guess he was just that or him snag. I can't really tell. Yeah, we got one. Oh, he popped the hook. That's okay, it made it easy on me. He was probably about 15, 20 pounds. Yeah, it was weird. He bit the hook and then I didn't know if he was on there or not, so I didn't really get a good hook set. But let's get him back out there. That's a good sign though. They're eating stuff other than shad. The screen's all fogged up. But yeah, you see how they take it down like yeah. that? That's like a... I saw it. You feel big? I can't, I wouldn't have any sense. It looks like he might be pretty big. Really nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Probably like 15 pounds. Just throw them in. Just 
Yeah. Set a hand there. There's a lot of snags out there and this is a this is a big fish. Oh man, I might not have control of this thing. I don't have any control of it out in that current. Oh. Oh man. Oh, this thing absolutely destroyed a carp bait. Lost a little weight after it got out of the current, but holy shit did that thing pull some drag. This is where we want to fight this fish. That is a fish. Man, if only I got this thing when it hit this bait. Fifty one inches. Ah. Okay guys, had this one out of the water long enough. 51 inches, 57 pounds. Absolute beast. All right guys, well, 
he swam off it's a little dark now i'm gonna get the hell out of here because uh i was freezing well before that fish bit and uh that thing warmed me up just from adrenaline but uh definitely gonna definitely gonna be cold on my way back here so i'll reconvene it once i get back to the ramp okay guys made it back to the ramp <clears throat> Yep, that was a real nice fish, but I ended up catching that thing um, out in the main channel using a common carp uh, cut up a uh, body chunk of it. That is my absolute favorite bait in this river for Missouri River. I don't know about all the other rivers because I don't fish them all that much. I only know this river and I know that they love those common carp. So if you can get a hold of those, uh, not only are you doing the ecosystem a favor by getting rid of some of those things, but you're also dealing with some excellent catfish bait. So um, that's what I would definitely be striving to get. You can find them in a lot of creeks right now, and especially as it gets warmer. So stay tuned and uh, hope to catch you on the next one.